What a great horror game! Don't rush this too much, otherwise you'll cock it up. And it's not meant to be offensive. Uh, pardon me. Alright. Ah, oh, I messed it up. Son of a bitch. I'm tilted, so I'm rushing. God damn it. You're tilted? Yeah, it's it's a popular gaming phrase for um like when you tilt a pinball machine. I know, what does that have to do with this though? I messed up so many times that I basically have locked up. I told you, don't rush. If you rush, you'll, you'll cock it up, okay? Okay. Up. Correct. All right. Yeah, so now the spider doesn't see you. Shit, that did not work. Yes, it did. I think you have to... Oh, it did. You're right. There you go. There you go. I, I forgot about the spider. Ooh. You did it. Two more levels of spiders to go, Proust. Two more. Hey, look at those before and after pictures. Other kin. I like that that's how you put it. It's pretty cool. Grocery list. Hey, man, should have a new client. Guy's interested in pre-war transmitting equipment. He's got the dough to pay for it. Doesn't need to be mint, but has to be working condition. He's looking for an antenna. Uh, Dual-mounted receiver. V4 encoding chip. Counting on you, buddy. Don't screw this up. Victory, the last parts you sent me last week were fucking useless. I managed to salvage the antenna, but the receiver was busted around repair, and the rest was rusted all to hell. Where did you even get this stuff? Did you dig it out of the fucking trash? Needless to say, the client's not paying for this crap. I had to offer him a discount on my premium stuff just to keep us in business. You're on thin fucking ice, my furry friend. <laughs> you pull a stunt like that again, and you'll have to look for a new dealer. Victory, you're f this freakish charade needs to stop now. Mom and Dad are terrified, and I don't blame them. The whole gene splicing obsession is one thing, but the packages you've been sending them, whatever you think they did to you, this is fucking cruel and unusual. Vic, you're my brother, and I love you even if you decide to grow an extra leg and a set of horns, but please keep Mom and Pop out of it. You want them to accept you for who you are? Just talk to them. Help them understand. I know you're not delusional, so please go back to your family. We're not your enemies. We're hoping to hear from you soon. Anka. Hey buddy, I got your message. Frankly, it couldn't have come of a worse time. These past few months have been pretty hard. Eli Eliza is out of a job, again, mm -hmm. and with a baby on the way, I've been pulling double shifts to save up some dough. We want to have a little one, have the little one spliced as soon as it gets here. In other words, sorry, I just don't have that kind of money. It's not that I don't trust you, I know you'd pay me back, I just can't help you out this time. I hope you figure something out. Hang in there. Matt, P.S. Ain't your parents rich or something? I hear they moved to B District. Can't you just ask them for a loan? Dear Sir, we at Baller Genetics and Augmentations are deeply saddened by the fact that you're unsatisfied with the results of your gene splicing therapy. BG&A employs only the best experts in the field and use state-of-the-art equipment in order to meet all of our patients' needs. However, we fully acknowledge a patient's right to have immensely high expectations, even if, objectively speaking, they would be found unrealistic. We are unable to provide you with specific details regarding your treatment. We would like to remind you that in cases requiring use of genetic material from extinct species, in this can can instance, Canis lupus, wolves are extinct. No! That's upsetting! 
Experts compose unique strains obtained from our gene library. Unfortunately, we are not able to provide you a list of our donor species or to confirm or deny whether a given species was used in the procedure. We would also like to remind you that the affirmation facts were stated in no uncertain terms in the pre-procedure contract. Finally, we feel obliged to inform you that malicious DNA tampering is a very serious accusation, one that should not be leveled with lightly. Unless one has strong evidence to support their claim, any unfounded accusations made against B and GNA will be made publicly or in further correspondence between the slanderous and will be met with decisive legal action. Hot. Hot garbage. Oh, Jesus. Custom item. Artificial leather lambskin. Custom item. Brilliant copper and chrome nickel. A splicer, a lunatic, and a junkie. Perfect combo. There's something else over there on the... Okay. Yeah, there you go. Hair. Abnormal genetic structure detected. It's a bird. It's a burg. It's a burp. A dead burp. Don't let Alex around it. He might stick his dick in it. Sheriff Big B went off the deep end. I wish you'd waited to hear that, Bruce. Because now there's going to be a human head under there, and we won't get to hear the entire message. No. Oh, God. No. This can't be happening. It's not is that our boy child? That is our child, I guess. Well, I guess we're connecting to the head. I need your help. There's a place it's called Sanctuary. Adam. Adam. Just try to try to call me back. God damn it. Don't connect with the head, he says. Well, they, can we listen to that tape recorder now? All right, so do we connect with the head, or do we... It is marked as optional. So we don't have to connect to the head. Find sanctuary is the other option. Hmm. What do you want to do, Priest? Let's talk this out. <sighs> well, we can either connect to the head... Or we can leave it and go find sanctuary. Um, All right. Oh, interesting. Um, uh, what are your feelings on this? I'll tell you my feelings on this, and let's ask the chat. I feel like the smartest thing to do is to probably trust our son. Um, but on the other hand, this is also supposed to be a horror game, and every time we connect to one of these things, it's horrifying. So maybe that's what people want to see. Um, I'm I am a I'm a creature built around curiosity. I'll be honest. So I really want to see what's in the head. But at the same time, I do feel like it's the wrong choice. I don't feel like it's the right choice. So I'm I'm stuck between my curiosity and instincts. And, and this game auto saves, so there's no going back. Yeah, exactly. So like this this is it. Like it feels like the right thing to do is not fucking connect to that head. That sounds like bad news. At the same time, I really want to know. 
So, uh, hey, chat, what is your take on this? We will take what you say into account. What do you guys want to see Priest do? Plum already knows what the right thing to do is, so he's not weighing in. If we don't connect to the head, we can't come back to it. I would believe it. We got some people watching right now. We got quite a few. So, would love to hear. And I, I'll call you out by name, guys. I know where you are. Let's play, sir. Captain Yard. Brian Necros. Alex underscore. What do you guys want us to do? They're all being silent. They don't want to, like, jinx everything. Brian says he doesn't know, but he'd say no. Hmm. I mean, because we can't, like, make a hard save. Oh. Nope. Sorry, Brian. I'll keep that in mind. Alex, we're asking you. Take it. <laughs> Plum. All right. Um, this placer says yes. That's not an answer. I'm saying option A or option B. I think it, he meant yes to connect to the head. All right. Um, so that's one yes and one no. We have one no. And I, I am a hesitant no myself. <sighs> I'm a pretty hesitant no. But God, I want to know. I want to know so badly! Oh, God. What if we cock it up? Okay. Like, um, I'll actually ask Professor Plum. Plum, if we connect to this head, will it completely change, like, the rest of the game? Will we cock everything up? What's the worst that could happen? <laughs> we, we've ruined this game again. We've ruined games before, so I just want to make sure that we don't, you know, do that. This is the final decision in the game. This is the big th decision, Freeze. This is it. Uh, I say we find our son then. That's what all this has been leading up to. I say we find our son. What do you guys think? How do you feel, Freeze? I say we trust our son. Because we've seen that there's so many different things in this world. People's, like, minds and bodies can be transferred to other beings. So maybe while our son isn't in his original host and our, his original body, maybe he's still okay. So, All right. let's go. Let's find our son. Let's go find our boy child. Okay. Turn around. I'm just curious. Turn around. I'm just curious. Okay, I was curious if it like it just blocked off the way. Plum is chortling. Now I'm upset. Weird. All systems go? I can. I couldn't scan it. What was that? I don't know. I don't like it. Thanks. 
Okay, click the other ones, I guess. 